guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Tommy. On this channel, we talk about mental health recovery from an eating disorder's perspective. We do a lot of mental health topics. We do vlogs, nutrition, fitness, all that good stuff. So please click on the notification bell, be notified of future uploads and join the clan. Today what I want to do, I want to take you through some of my meals, what I eat in a day. As you know in my past video, if you haven't, please go and click it up in the link up above. From Muscle Food, I actually sent me a big meal plan from Live Clean, which is basically a meal prep service where you get free meals, snacks, breakfast, lunch and dinner, obviously each day for seven days. Obviously all the calories are obviously tailored to your needs as well which is absolutely amazing so if you're looking to get a certain amount of calories for your goal it's absolutely great like i say all your macros are looked after it's quick it's convenient it's absolutely amazing i'm really enjoying it i have had been with muscle food for quite a long time but this is the first time i've had their seven day plan and i'm absolutely proud to join their ambassador program and obviously help share things with you guys so i'm just going to do a little voiceover clips on all my meals and things like that, take you through the day. I'm obviously going to do this for probably what all days I'll check in in seven days from now as well and give you an update on how it's all went. But I'll take you through an entire days of food as well, and then I'll obviously seven days time, probably next Saturday because this is Saturday just now. I'll tell you how I'm feeling, how it's went through the week, and what I've found how it's helped obviously with my lifestyle and obviously my health goals as well guys so please stay with us let's check it out let's get into it and like i say i'll put all the links for the, the description down below if you want to get a box like i say you'll get 10 pound off your first box with the code tommy10 and you can cancel it anytime as well guys please go and check it out i think you'll absolutely love it there's great products like i say it caters to all lifestyles as well, from plant-based to obviously omnivorous. It's even got some keto things in there, the carb killer bars and things like that. So let's get stuck into it, guys. So guys, welcome back to day number 11 of the 25 day push up challenge raising awareness for post traumatic stress disorder. We're almost halfway there. I've got quite a lot of doms in the arms and things like that at the moment but I'm going to push through this. Press ups are always my thing anyway, I love doing them. But what I'm going to do today is I'm going to do press up jacks. They're an amazing movement for the chest, the backs, the arms and the core as well. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to start in a high plank position. Your arms just a little bit wider than shoulder width apart and you're going to stay rigid throughout the body. You're going to come down to a press up position. You're going to do the, the jack, come back up, put, bring your legs back in and then repeat the movement. So we're going to do 25 of them. If you're following me on Facebook, like I say, I'll put all the description down below. If you're on Instagram and you're watching this video, if you want to do the exercise, just send me a message. I'll take you through any pointers as well. So let's get stuck into this. So what you're going to do, start on a high plank position. You're going to come down, you're going to come out, back in. 25 of those.
So guys, what we're going to have for lunch is we're going to have this meat-free, the Brit Abroad High Protein Pot. It's mock meat pieces marinated in brown sauce with potatoes, spinach, tomatoes and baked beans. So it's basically a lunch slash brunch and it's obviously got 21 grams of protein and I'm joined by my little friend here, my Labrador Penny. <laughs> she's wanting to see what it's like, she's wanting to see if it's worthy for eating. So we're going to get stuck into this. It's in the microwave at the moment. I've got it on for roughly four or five minutes. So guys, here it is. The milk pieces, the potatoes, the tomatoes and the spinach. I'm obviously going to throw some brown sauce on this as well. Give it a little bit of a breakfast kick. Even though it is marinated in brown sauce. And yeah, that's my grumpy cup. That was, that was given through me from my dad. Before he passed, I've still got it to this day, like I say, it was my dad's cup, so he gave it to me eventually. I'm proud mommy. So, let's get stuck into this bad boy, let's see if it's any good at all. So, milk peas, potatoes. It's not bad. Not quite to my taste, I must admit, but it's, it's decent. It's okay. I would probably give that a 5 out of 10 if I'm being honest guys. I'm not going to say something's great when it's not. It's, it's not bad but then again I'm not much of a mock meat piece person. I used to have it quite a lot. I've been off it for a long time now because it kind of upsets my stomach so I've got to only have a few meals here and there. As you can see here I've got the beard going as well. Penny, what did you think? Do you think it's any good? You want to give it a try? No, Penny's, Penny's no, Penny says no. So guys, here it is, chicken curry, it looks absolutely amazing. This is going to be my dinner tonight, like I say, this is actually 433 calories as well, which is absolutely great, 33 grams of protein, and the carbohydrates are 51 grams of protein, and the fibre 6 grams as well, and fat is 13 grams, so really good ratios as well guys, let's give it a little try and see what they think. So guys, here goes. I got a bit of each. On point. Healthy curry. And I'm talking my mouthful. I'm talking my mouthful. Typical me. On point, guys. As I say, it's feeding time. I'm going to go in and finish this and I'll see you all at supper time. So guys, I'm having a third meal of the day. This is actually the honey chicken with whole mustard tray bake. 408 calories. It's got, as you can see, 33 grams of protein. I'm having roughly 180 grams of protein to a day. So basically what you do is obviously, this is all the instructions here, as you can see, preheat the oven, and obviously gas mark seven. You obviously cut the potatoes into small cubes, carrots into roundels, peppers into small chunks, and red onion into wedges, and put to one side. The veg is done. Add your honey, your whole grain mustard and vinegar into a small bowl. This is the honey mustard marinade. Slice your chicken down the middle of the breast. Create in two small fillets and place to one side of the bacon tray to one side. Add your veggies to the other tray and obviously drizzle over a small olive oil season to taste. Place in the oven for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, obviously use half of the marinade and then 
another 20 minutes later, obviously use the rest, drizzle, drizzle over the top as well. So that's in the oven, it'll actually put a little clip up here showing you that. Just done all the prep beforehand to make it a lot easier. And I'll do a little taste test after it. Let's get stuck into it. Give me the food. So let's get stuck into this bad boy. Here it is here. Looks absolutely amazing. I'm gonna take a bit of the chicken first. This is the honey mustard chicken. Bellissimo! Some of the veggies. Nice and soft as well. Bit of the mustard potatoes. I've, I've actually drizzled mustard over the potatoes as well. Perfect. That is on point guys. Absolutely on point. I'm going to go and enjoy this stuck into this and I'll see you all in the next meal. Let's get it done. Day 13 of the 25 day press up challenge raising awareness for post traumatic stress disorder. Today we're going to do lateral push ups so let's get into it. I'll put all the description down below if you're following me on Facebook. If you're on Instagram just send me a message I'll take you through it as well. 25 of these. So we're going to start up in a flat position, going to move your hands laterally to the side. So guys, day number 12 of the 25 day push up challenge raising awareness for post traumatic stress disorder. Today I want to do press ups with a knee to an elbow which is a bit of a rotational move so what you're going to do is you're going to come into a high plank position, Our hands show just a little bit wider than shoulder width for part. You're going to bring, you're going to come down into your press up and as you come up you're going to rotate one leg to the opposite elbow and then another, a bit like a spider clip, spider man press up, mountain climber type thing. Great for the rotational muscles that obviously as well and the abs. So this is how you're going to do it guys. You're just going to regular press up, come down into your press up and as you come, bringing that elbow over and then another one. So 25 of those. Making sure obviously to keep the back in alignment as well. Done. So guys, day number 14 of the 25 day push up challenge raising awareness for post traumatic stress disorder. Today I'm going to do a little super set, so a half burpee into a squat thrust, into a press up. Let's get it done.
open. So I'm just going to have these brave roasted chickpeas with sea salt, 136 calories, 7 grams of protein, 5 grams of fibre, and I'm going to get stuck in on my laptop, as you can actually just see here, I'm actually, what I'm, I'm actually doing is I'm actually doing a course for a GP referral course to obviously enhance my personal training, and I've got my little mascots here, Sasha, Boy, boy. Well, let's get stuck into it. And then what I'll probably do for supper, I'm going to have a hot chocolate, which is options white hot chocolate with almond milk and a protein bar. And that's me finito for the rest of the day. Well guys it's the next day I hope you've enjoyed that little day of food just give you some ideas what's on the live clean plan like I say if you obviously want to try a box it's no obligation you can obviously cancel at any time you get 10 pounds off with my code Tommy10 I'll put that down in the description like I say amazing food I really like some of the food some of it wasn't to my taste I must be admit but yeah, for the most part, absolutely great. Like I say, really easy to obviously get everything that you need. And like I say, if you want to obviously add in a bit more food to obviously meet your goals, if you're looking to build muscle like myself and obviously gain weight, just add in a little bit more protein, carbs and fat. So yeah, I hope that gave you some ideas. Here's Fudgy Boy, he's just woke up as always. <laughs> What's he like? He even enjoyed the food. He's quite happy that I'm back eating the, the nutritious, good, nutritious food. <laughs> Aren't you, Fudgy? So you're going to say bye? Says bye. Speeches on the next one, guys. <laughs>